Hi, this is Google Kickstart uh, question round G. Uh, happy sub arrays. Uh, so you are given an array of uh, positive and negative uh, integers, and uh, you need to find uh, uh, the uh, the happy arrays. And uh, for every happy array, we need to calculate. Uh, the sum of all of uh, prefix uh, subarrays. Now the happy uh, array is uh, the array that all of its prefix uh, subarrays have uh, uh, sum greater than or equal to zero. So for example, if we take this subarray, the prefix arrays are three, three minus two then 3 minus 2 and 4 the sum of all elements here are 3 which is uh, positive and for this one 3 plus minus 2 is 1 this is positive 3 plus minus 2 is uh, uh, 1 plus 4 is uh, 5 and again this is greater than or equal to 0 and you can see all the sum are positive and so this is uh, consider happy uh, sub array or happy array now if you take this one if you add the minus six this is not a happy array because one of its uh, prefix uh, uh, sub arrays is three three minus two four minus 6 and the summation of this is uh, 3 plus minus 2 1 plus 4 5 uh, minus 6 equal minus 1 so this is uh, negative and that means that uh, this uh, this array here is not happy array while uh, this array here is happy array now let's find all the uh, happy arrays in this uh, array we start with one with from one we go until the summation become negative so one plus minus two is negative so we stop here and we know that this one is uh, uh, happy array minus two we cannot uh, uh, minus 2 cannot be the beginning of uh, happy array because it's uh, negative 3 so we start from 3 plus minus 1 uh, plus minus 2 is uh, positive plus 4 is positive we keep going plus minus 6 is negative so we know that this is our uh, happy array up to 4 next is minus 2 minus 2 cannot be beginning of happy array because it's negative 4 uh, 4 is uh, good it's positive plus minus 6 is uh, negative so we stop here so this is happy array the 4 only minus 6 is negative uh, 2 2 uh, is positive plus 4 uh, equal 6 so the whole 2 uh, this is this sub array is a happy array then 4 4 is positive this is also a happy array now let's find the sum of prefix uh, prefix sub arrays of all these happy array uh, so for this uh, uh, for this happy array, we have only the, this prefix uh, array, which has uh, the submission equal 1. So we add this to our answer. Plus, now for the next uh, sub array, in the red color, we have this uh, uh, prefix sub arrays 3, 3 minus 2, 3 minus 2, 4. The sum of this is a 3, sum of this is 3 plus minus 2 is 1, for this is uh, 5, and sum of all of them is 3 plus 1, 4 plus 5, uh, equal 9, so we add this to our answer, plus. Now for the blue one, we have only this uh, sub array, 
which is uh, 4 so we add 4 to our uh, answer because its sum is 4 then we go to this blue happy array we have this uh, prefix uh, sub arrays 2 2 4 sum of 2 is 2 sum of 2 and 4 are 6 now 2 plus 6 8 so we add this to our answer then for the last happy array 4 we have the sum uh, only sub array 4 so we add this to our answer 4 plus 8 12 plus 4 uh, 16 plus 9 25 plus 1 26 so this will be our uh, final answer now the question is uh, how can we know uh, starting at this uh, for example this index up to which uh, element our uh, happy array because we know we, if we keep looping like 3 plus minus 2 plus 4 and we stop here but we need to do it uh, in an efficient uh, way so if we store uh, prefix sum array uh, let's calculate it let's uh, start with 1 uh, then minus 2 plus 1 is uh, minus 1 3 plus minus 1 is 2 minus 2 uh, plus 2 is 0 then 4 plus 0 minus 6 plus 4 is minus 2 2 plus minus 2 is 0 4 plus 0 is uh, 4 so this is our pr prefix uh, uh, sum and this tell us for every element let's say this one the prefix sum is 2 and this means that uh, the sum of all items from the beginning up to this element are equal to 2 and let's say this element so the sum of all items from the beginning up to minus 6 is uh, minus 2 So as uh, we said we need to know for the happy array where to stop and if we are at index uh, 3 uh, so at index 3 this is our uh, happy array so we need to know uh, this index uh, the indexes here are 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and notice that the summation of uh, this happy array is actually the difference between uh, this and uh, this so uh, the prefix uh, sum of at index 4 equal to 4 this means that this is the sum of all elements up to 4 the prefix sum of uh, at index 1 uh, equal minus 1 and this means that uh, uh, this is the sum of all elements up to uh, minus 1 so we will take the prefix sum of uh, uh, 4 minus uh, prefix uh, sum of uh, 1 1 is less by 1 than our index we are iterating over this item this is uh, the sum of uh, this equal to uh, 4 minus minus 1 equal 4 plus 1 equal 5 and indeed our sub uh, or our happy array sum is 3 plus minus 2 uh, uh, 1 plus 4 equal 5 so using prefix sub array we can calculate uh, the sum of uh, our uh, happy array but the point is at this index at 2 we need to know the next uh, index for uh, our happy array so assume we are at uh, 
index x so prefix of uh, or index i so prefix x x is uh, this one the one we need to calculate minus prefix of uh, i which is 2 in this case minus 1 as we said we uh, decrement up to this minus 1 this should be greater than 0 in order to uh, have a happy uh, array or happy sub array and in order to calculate x we need to find uh, the condition that break this rule so we need to find y such that prefix of y minus prefix of uh, i minus 1 less than 0 so y is the first element in uh, the prefix sum that if we uh, do uh, prefix of y minus prefix of i minus 1 it become less than 0 so we know uh, here the condition breaks so our result will be y, y minus uh, uh, 1 and to do that we need to calculate the uh, next smaller element in the prefix uh, uh, sum for every uh, item so at the 3 at this here we will say we need the next great uh, smaller element of uh, minus 1 why we need this because we know this the smaller element than minus 1 minus minus 1 will be less than 0 then that answer we will take uh, minus 1 so for example here what is the first element that uh, less than minus 1 uh, it's not 2 not 0 not 4 it's minus 2 so we know that the element before minus 2 is uh, is the end of our happy uh, array so we need in order to do that we need to calculate another uh, array which is uh, next smaller uh, element for this uh, array prefix sum and to do that there are there is algorithm uh, a simple one for that use monotonic uh, stack so now we have our uh, uh, this array calculated now at any point of uh, the array we can determine up to where we can uh, or up to which index we can this uh, uh, our happy, happy array will be but again we need to uh, find the sum of all the prefix sum uh, of this happy uh, array and we need to calculate that in an efficient uh, way and uh, to do that uh, let's let's uh, do this so uh, our sub arrays are two or and then so for our sub arrays are three is this 3 minus 2 then 3 minus 2 uh, and 4 these are uh, the three sub arrays and for 3 we said it's uh, actually prefix sum of uh, this index which is 2 minus the prefix sum of uh, this one prefix of uh, 2 minus 1 which is 1 
because we agreed that the sum of all of these elements up to this element minus the sum of all of these elements up to this will equal to uh, our subarrays. Now let's calculate for the second one, for this one, our sum will be prefix of uh, three here minus prefix of uh, this one. Then let's calculate for the third uh, prefix, prefix of which end which uh, end up to four, so it will be four minus prefix of again uh, one. So we have uh, this three expression. And as we said for this one, for example, prefix four, it will calculate up to four minus uh, up to one. This will be the sum of all these three elements, which is the last expression. So now we have uh, this three expression and uh, you see, if you take the summation of all uh, these three, uh, the result will be prefix of uh, two plus, uh, let me write it here. So it is prefix of two plus minus prefix of one plus the second uh, expression is prefix of three minus prefix of one plus the last one prefix of four minus prefix of one so this is the summation of all these uh, three sub arrays and uh, let's rewrite it and we put uh, prefix of two plus let's take this three prefix of three plus prefix of four now we have three prefix of one so minus three multiply prefix of one now Now to calculate uh, this expression here, prefix of two plus prefix of uh, three plus prefix of four in an efficient way, we can calculate uh, another uh, array, uh, which is uh, prefix, prefix, let's call it, so our uh, new array is uh, prefix, prefix, underscore prefix. And we will use our prefix uh, subarrays. So let's write our prefix subarrays first. Prefix of array one plus minus two uh, minus one plus three two and plus minus two zero plus four uh, minus six minus two zero four. Now we need to do prefix sum of pre this uh, array. So we start with uh, one one plus minus one zero. 0 plus 2, 2, plus 0, 2, uh, plus uh, 4, 6, uh, 6 plus minus 2 is uh, 4, plus 0, 4, plus 4, 8, so this is our prefix prefix uh, array 
and now the expression prefix of uh, two which is uh, this one plus prefix of three plus prefix of uh, four we can calculate it using using uh, this array which is prefix of uh, or prefix prefix of the sum up to here which is six minus this sum of uh, these or sorry sum of uh, these so the summation or of the, these three items is the difference between six minus uh, zero equal uh, zero and indeed two plus zero plus four equals six and this is uh, six so to calculate this expression we can just do prefix prefix of uh, the last item four minus uh, this item minus one so prefix of uh, prefix of one and that means that this is equal to um, this whole expression become like prefix prefix of uh, prefix prefix of uh, of four minus uh, prefix uh, prefix of two minus one one so this expression represents the summation of these three minus three multiplied by prefix of uh, one which is again one is uh, one element or one index less than our uh, element now what is three three is uh, the length of our uh, happy array so we know that uh, this is x and we know this is uh, for example y so the three is x minus y plus uh, one that's all uh, so to calculate the prefix array time complexity is pick of n to, uh, to calculate uh, uh, prefix prefix time complexity is also pick of n and to calculate the next smaller element using uh, prefix array so using monotonic stack it will take also pick of uh, n so the time complexity of uh, finding the summation of all the happy arrays is pick uh, uh, of n uh, let's see the uh, implementation So here we have uh, the input array, yeah, we parse it uh, here, and we have n. First of all, we calculate the prefix uh, array, then we calculate the prefix, uh, prefix uh, array, which is the prefix of this one then we calculate uh, the next smaller uh, array for using the prefix array and uh, here uh, because remember we used uh, when we do the calculation we do for i minus one for so if you are at index zero and you want to know the next smaller element so you need to take the index minus one so we need to uh, find the value of this is this loop also only to calculate for uh, index uh, zero 
and you can merge it for with this for loop but this is uh, easier so for this one uh, uh, the first time you see a negative integer you can break and that will be your uh, next smaller element only for uh, the zero and for other elements uh, uh, we calculated using uh, monotonic stack now this loop will calculate our uh, final answer first of all we uh, we calculate the prefix prefix of uh, uh, the left uh, side uh, so uh, prefix uh, which is prefix prefix of i minus uh, one then we need to get the next smaller uh, element uh, index using the area we calculated if it's not zero if it's zero we use this uh, value then we need to uh, find the prefix prefix uh, for uh, the right uh, element so this next smaller element we know that uh, it will tell us where is the right boundary of our happy uh, array because it will be next to smaller minus one and by that we can calculate uh, the prefix prefix uh, for the right uh, side then we need the uh, prefix uh, for uh, the left side to multiply it with the number of uh, items using this uh, equation prefix prefix four minus prefix prefix of one which is i minus one minus uh, Three, three is uh, the number of uh, items of the happy array multiplied by PL. PL is uh, the prefix of I minus one, which is here prefix of uh, one. 